Well, the last part of our install is the turbo timer from Painless Performance. What this thing does is actually give you more life out of your turbo. Well, how do you do that? Well, with a turbo diesel, you get a lot of heat inside the turbo when you're doing all that heavy pulling. To keep it alive, you've got to get that heat out. So when you go key off ignition, what this turbo timer does is actually keep the truck running. What's nice about it, it's set it and forget it. You set it initially as how long you want the truck to run for, and that's what it'll do. It'll let it run at an idle to help it dissipate heat. By doing so, you get a lot more life out of your turbo. It's connected, it's pretty simple. You got the wiring hearts that plugs in. There's two main connections you need to make underneath. One to the brake switch and one to the ignition. The ignition, once you cut it off, starts the timer, lets the truck keep running. Biggest thing is you think to yourself, wow, I'm gonna get out of the truck and leave it running? Well, if someone hops in to steal it, that's where that brake switch connection comes into place. Once they hit the brake to actually put it into gear, it actually kills the ignition. So you don't have to worry about somebody hopping in and stealing your ride. You're gonna get a lot more life out of your turbo. I'm gonna go ahead and make the necessary connections underneath. In the meantime, why don't we take a look at a turbo installation on our Build to Bonneville. For more information on anything you've seen on today's show, check out speedtv.com or visit our website at truckutv.com. Bruno, I'm back, dude. What hey you checking man, out, man? Hey, glad you made it, bud. Cool, there you go, buddy. I got that can. Hey, welcome back to Truck U. I'll tell you what, dude, you would not believe what I went through to get that can. But really? finally, I'm back, dude. No, it's all I think good. I would, actually. Dude, traffic was tough, dude. Anyway, yeah, it's all good. Now we're rolling. Hey, well, Matt actually made it back here, and he brought the seven-gallon can with yeah. us now. This thing comes with a two-quart can, but definitely not going to be able to handle what we're doing. We're going to be doing some serious pulling, so we're going to use a lot of liquid to cool this thing down. The seven gallons is what we're going to need, so this should get it done. Absolutely. Now, all we have to do is plumb that up and get it ready to go. You want me to move that little one, dude? Yeah, it'd be fine. I've got to make two little connections here. One's our right. electrical. Next thing I do is put our supply, li supply line on, go into our fuel pump. Hey, we've got the pump right down there that actually shoots it up to the front. The reason we mounted that pump down there earlier today in the back side of the bed is there's a couple different reasons. Pumps are designed to pull push, not pull. So if you've got it up there in the front, it's got to suck all that fluid up there to the front and you're going to burn through a lot of pumps. So not that there's any room underneath the hood of this thing anyway. So gravity will feed the pump. It'll push it up there. Everything's good to go. Now make sure before you mix your, mi mix your mixture, go ahead and do it outside. Put your water and your methanol together. You'll be a little more accurate that way. Then go ahead and dump it into the tank. You know, I would try to say that 10 times, but it might get a little bit It's tricky. a little tough. Hey, gadgets <laughs> gone wild. That's what this truck is all about, man. That, I mean, think about what we did today. We've got the, uh, we've got the, the cold shot, Right? The turbo timer. The turbo timer. We've got the program module. I mean, you, this is why we call it Franken Truck, really. If you want to see Franken Truck in motion, come see this. Oh, it's missing. There's two big bolts on the side of this thing, and it'd be good to go. So it's, I don't know, dude, but listen, seriously, what were you checking out? I want to see this. Hey, dude, how is that CD? Though? What? What's the work truck doing on the GPS, dude? Dude, GPS works, my friend. It does. Well, all right. Winger, greatest hits, dude. You know it rocks, man. Everything was cool, right? Dude, at least tell me the movie was good. The movie wasn't good. Busted. I told you he disappears on me all the time. I actually thought I was going to get away with something today, <laughs> so no can do. All right, that's going to wrap it up for us today at Truck U. We'll catch you next time around, dude. The popcorn was, was stale. I got a Slurpee, dude. Thanks it for inviting me, good. bro. I would appreciate it.